As the pandemic uh, continues, a remembrance tree returns to the city of Henderson. It allows people to hang ornaments in memory of a loved one. Eyewitness News' Cody Bailey is live in Henderson now. How can you remember someone important in your life? Cody? Good evening, Brad. This is the Remembrance Tree behind me. It's located inside the gazebo at Central Park as a part of Henderson's Christmas in the Park. And while the tree has only been up for not even one week yet, the ornaments are starting to fill up and fill up pretty quickly. This is the second year for the Remembrance Tree. It began in 2020 after being proposed by a Parks and Recreation board member here in the city of Henderson. The tree allows for individuals or families to bring a special ornament to the tree to honor a loved one who's no longer with us. Ornaments can be handmade or purchased, but officials do recommend that the ornaments used will be made to withstand the winter conditions. Parks and Recreation Director Trace Stevens says this new tradition is a heartwarming one for the entire department. One of the things that the Parks Department always does is try to find a way to help people make memories in our park. And this is one of the easiest ways to do it. And it turned out to be a one of the most positive ways to people to remember others. Stephen says the tree will be up through January 3rd, and you can retrieve your ornament by simply coming to the tree or stopping by the Parks Department office after January the 3rd. Now, the Remembrance Tree is specific for Christmas in the Park for now here in Henderson. But coming up on Eyewitness News Live at 5, we'll learn more about the purpose of the tree's plans for after the holiday season. That's coming up again at 5 on ABC 25. Reporting live in Henderson, Cody Bailey, Eyewitness News.